City of Pink today at the Capitol. More than 5,000 people coming out for the 10th anniversary of the Mid Michigan Susan G. Komen Race for the Cure. Shannon Cantor tells us why one family no longer takes life for granted. When Michelle Dunlap was 30 weeks pregnant, she got the scariest news of her life. She had stage three breast cancer. When she was born, we called her a miracle baby because uh, we had I had the surgery and uh, the chemo treatments while I was pregnant in order to be here after she was born. That was four years ago, and this is the fourth time Alana joined her mom on the stairs of the Capitol for the survivor walk. At least 300 others stood with them, and thousands walked or ran. In the race, um, it's something I can do to remember everything that we've been through. I'm here celebrating and, and savoring every minute I have. And so is the rest of her family. It means a lot just to support her and the girls and show the girls how important it is to be with family. This race brought in more than $150,000 just in donations. And up to 75% of that gets to stay right here to help fund programs that might find a cure. For grants for women that um, need screening, that don't have insurance, or aren't qualified to get screening for survivor programs. So it's a very robust um, program, and we connect out to many different areas in the community. And that community has Dunlap excited to come back next year. Live every day like it's your last day. Don't take it for granted. And uh, keep your support system close by. In Lansing, Shannon Kantner, Fox 47 News. All right, and all the race raised more than $300,000, surpassing its fundraising goal. If you couldn't make it out today, there's still time to donate online. We've put a link up under our Facebook page. That is Fox 47 News.